imagine writing a letter to Santa and hearing nothing back. That thought is the driving force behind an Ocoee woman's work. Yeah, she's getting results. She wants to make sure kids know Santa reads their letters and responds to. News 6 reporter Eric Sandoval is live at the Ocoee Post Office with more on this fantastic story. Eric. Yeah, guys, this woman has been a rural letter, letter carrier here at the Ocoee Post Office for 22 years. She said she got really concerned when she saw letters to Santa piling up inside. So that's when she decided to step in and help him. These kids go through some work to to write to Santa. Kathy Marlowe says she's been helping Santa out, reading these letters to him for several years now. Dear Santa and Mrs. Qualls and the elves, I only want a few things for Christmas. It's not a lot, it's five things. With her postmaster's blessing, she says she picks up envelopes addressed to the North Pole by the handful. She says she brings them home, reads them, and then she says she makes sure to send each household a letter back. Children usually get the same letter. No matter how busy we are, we always make time to go through all the cards and letters we receive each day. With his permission, she signs each letter with Santa's name and usually adds a handwritten note to go along with it. Marlo says it's a little thing, and she never knew how much these letters actually meant to the family she delivers mail to until she got a letter back. This one was addressed to Santa, but it was written by a mother. Thanks again for bringing joy to my kids. Love, Mommy, April. How does that make you feel? It was, it was like great. It was like, oh my gosh, I made somebody's day. Marlo says Santa isn't seeing as many letters this year, but it doesn't matter. She says even if he saw more, she would still sit at her table and help him make sure the children got a letter back. She says it's the magic of the season and it's her gift. Their heart goes into this, and so I just feel like my heart is for the children. Now, although there are no guarantees, Marlo does some, have some advice for uh, children and adults alike. She says, if you possibly want to get a response, make sure that you put a return address on the envelope that you send to Santa Claus. That way she and Santa know where to possibly send a letter to. We are live in Ocoee tonight. Eric Sandoval. New six. Matt, Lisa. E Eric, did she have some pointy shoes on? Because I think she's part <laughs> elf. <laughs> we didn't get a shot of that. All right, all right. Just a thought. Santa needs lots of helpers, and she's That's doing right. a great job. I love yeah. it. Well done. Mm -hmm.